Hello, welcome to my channel, Sparkly Things by Jay. I'm Jay, and this is a follow-up video to how to make an ergonomic bead mat. I made this follow-up video when I realized that I had two kinds of paint, and they both say that they're dimensional fabric paint, and they both work exactly the same way. They will both make a raised sort of a, a, a wall to help keep your beads in and they both dry and, and finish and perform exactly the same way. Now the only difference between these two, uh, and I didn't realize this until just recently, is that on this one it says that you can use an iron to activate the paint. And this was super easy to do with an iron. I just turned an iron on and I let it get hot and then I just used the steam setting and I just held it over this for a few seconds and you could see it change color and texture and then uh, it'll dry um, or cool and then this is the texture that you have when it's all done. So that's the difference between these two styles of paint. This paint is available in many different brands in a dimensional paint. This one, I've only seen it in this brand, maybe one other, but uh, mostly I see it in this brand. So as long as you make sure when you're buying this kind of paint that it's a dimensional fabric paint and you'll be fine. Thanks for watching and I hope you enjoy making your own bead mat. And again, if uh, you just want to buy one, uh, just visit my shop on Etsy. It's Sparkly Things by Jay. And be sure and like and subscribe this video and I will see you soon. Thank you. Bye.